Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Colton and this is Wisco Bricks. Hope you guys are having a great day. Today, what I have for you guys is a look into the brand new Architecture White House set. This is set number 21054 and it is for ages 18 up and it has 1,483 pieces. So pretty decent sized set here. If you look at the box, it does have that new look for adults here with the black box, not really all that colorful, but just displaying the actual Lego on it. If you rotate it around, it does have right here, it says the White House just in Spanish. And then on top, it gives kind of like a blueprint detail type of look to probably just the outline design of the actual White House. And on the back here, we have a nice full picture of the actual model again, as well as it does say the length, which is 18 and a half inches and the height, which is four and a half inches. And then also a nice, beautiful picture of the actual White House on the bottom. So a little bit different box design with the white strip, but for the most part, it's a pretty standard architecture. All right. Now jumping into the set here, this set definitely leaves a pretty big footprint being 18 and a half inches long. This set is very beautifully done with lots of tiled work for the roofs and then the pathways and the roads. It's just a very cleanly designed with the only studs that I wish that they would kind of cover up would be the grass. But on the other hand, it does look very nice either way. Now, like I said, the set is 1,483 pieces. Let me just give it a spin for you guys here so you can see all the angles. But this set took me, I would say probably about an hour and a half to build. There's a lot of really tiny little details that I can show you guys here in just a minute that really add to building it as well as just the amount of tiny, small pieces. Uh, let me just go over some of the f things I really like about it and some of the things I don't like about it. So some of the fun little things I do like about it is, first of all, that these sides can actually detach. So if you ever need to store it anywhere or anything of that sort or move it around, uh, you can just take these off nice and easy and they're pretty relatively flat too so you don't have to worry about pieces coming off. Uh, another thing that I do like are these actual like smaller trees right in the front and then on the back side of the main building here there's two more as well as all the smaller bushes up in the front here too. This set does include two printed pieces one being the American flag, which goes up on top here. And the other one being the actual text on the brick here that says White House. Um, there's no stickers or anything of that sort, so that's pretty nice to come from uh, an architecture set. I don't think that any architecture set has ever had stickers, but I guess I might be wrong. But now to some of the kind of intricate details of the White House here. So another fun part is definitely seeing how they put it all together, such as, so this is the roof, and then they put this stud holder right here into one of the modified studs so that the brick can be flipped upside down. Then the roof just sits right on top and it gives that nice 
little detail right here. Another fun part to build as well as actually see how it all comes together is definitely these inward pieces that you fit sideways. So you build it like this and you just layer all these plates and everything on top of one another. And then when you put it in there, it comes sideways with all like the little archways and windows and everything all basically coming together. Okay. Now that I got it all put back together here, uh, you guys, I'm gonna just explain just like a couple of little things that I don't really like about it. Uh, the first one being is actually this fountain right up front here. I think it just, it looks a little weird and there could have been a little bit better of a job. Uh, it doesn't completely degrade from the whole build, but it's a, kind of a little distracting if you ask me. Uh, another thing that I don't like is that you can't just pick up the whole thing from the middle here or from the sides because it'll all just fall apart. If you want to move it, you're going to have to take the sides off and then carry the three separate pieces. But besides that, it's a very clean build. Uh, it displays really nicely. So uh, I also, I do like the size of it. I think that the size is really nice to have a bigger architecture set but it doesn't have to be all that crazy tall or anything all right guys so this was my quick review of the architecture white house set all in all it's a great set it looks nice i can't wait to put it into our lego room once we have that up uh there's just a few things that i would change about it but besides that it is a great fantastic set Anyways, if you guys enjoyed the video and are looking forward to more content, please leave a like, comment, and then subscribe. Thank you guys for watching.